There are many new faces in the 2016-17 edition of the Prince Albert Raiders, including assistant coach Brandon Cote. You know, I'm enjoying it thoroughly. It's, uh, like I said at the start, uh, when I first took it, I, I was excited to get back in the league. Cote played in the WHL and was also head coach for the Bentley Generals when they won the Senior Allen Cup National Championship. He most recently was a head coach in the midget AAA level in Red Deer, Alberta. All have helped him prepare for this new challenge. I've been fortunate to have some real good coaches as well. Learned from Bill Peters and Trent Yanni and Mike Babcock and guys like that. And uh, you know, so so that having those people, um, having my teaching degree has helped. You know, those experiences as a head coach in those uh, higher level kind of amateur leagues have been good. And then you know, I've done a lot of work with Hockey Alberta, Hockey Canada. All those types of short-term competition experiences have helped along the way. Cote says one of the biggest challenges is making the transition from head coach to assistant coach. I'm very quiet, but yet at the same time, um, you know, I'm very kind of a uh, you know go-getter type guy who who wants to be in there and doing everything. And so taking a step back and seeing it from a different perspective has been real good for me. Since Cote is only a few years removed as a WHL player, veteran Austin Glover says that makes him easy to relate to. It's pretty fresh off playing the game, so he's got a, a modern touch, and he's he's um, you know really puts in a lot of effort and has some great ideas. So um, you know every day he's he's got things to teach us. Glover also says the lines of communication are wide open. He's got a real open door policy, and we can you know discuss things, and he's really uh, approachable. Although Cote does have quite a bit of coaching experience, he says he is learning a great deal from head coach Mark Habscheid and associate coach Dave Manson. It's been different for me at times, adjusting to being a, you know, an assistant coach versus a head coach. Because um, I, since I stopped playing, I was mostly uh, pretty much a head coach majority of my uh, young coaching career so far. But uh, you know, working with Habby and, and Manson every day, I've learned a lot. There is pressure and anxiety for any rookie, whether you're a player or a coach. But it appears Brandon Cote has made a smooth transition as a new coach in the WHL. For Seekers Inside Edge, I'm Drew Wilson.